After everything I went through with Briggs, I really want to start focusing on myself more. It's my 22nd birthday, and I rented a house in Portland to spend the night with my family and friends. Thank you guys for coming out, celebrating my birthday with me. Thanks for having us. Love for a better year this year. Yeah. The last. So much better. So much. <laughs> I really want a relaxing, fun celebration. But earlier today, I got an unexpected phone call. I got a call from my dad. I didn't answer, but it sucks. It like affects me because he's never called me on my birthday before, except for this year. And it's because this year he got Facebook for the first time. So it's like you kind of like needed Facebook to remind you it was my birthday. It's just, it, it sucks. What do you think like this next year holds for you, like 22? I think in like some ways, I feel like I wish I had more time to be young and be 22 and not have all the responsibility of having a kid. But I love him and I would do anything for him, so it's worth it to me. Mm -hmm. I know like I'm a single mom, but you are too. I mean, you did it by yourself. My, you know, my yes. person, sperm donor. Two whole kids without anyone. But he messaged me on my birthday, first time in 22 years. It's his first time he's ever, ever messaged, messaged you me and said or, happy birthday. or reached out to me for my birthday. Mm -hmm. But it's just irritating. It doesn't surprise me. I mean, do you want to talk to him? Do you want to try again? No, it's con I mean, it's such an Did open it relationship. You off when you saw it? I'm, yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah, because like the one year you've ever told me happy birthday is because. Facebook told you. I mean, this isn't gonna ruin my birthday. It's just frustrating. It's, it just sucks. It just sucks. But it's also like expected because this is how it's been for my entire life. Give me the kisses. Yay, mommy! Give mommy good sugars. No, like this. Mm -hmm. It's your birthday! Yay!